Hello everybody, my name is Beastly. I'm a friend of the Crafting Ant, and I would like to introduce you to a queen called, very aptly, Beastly. The colony is Camponotus Vargas, one of the biggest ants of Europe. She's a stunning queen, totally like her namesake, fully black with silver hairs on her abdomen. Join us on our journey as we explore the colony, and don't forget to stick around to see how she's progressed. Hint, it's impressive. Welcome to the Crafting Ant. As my friend Beasley already told you, we will be talking about Campanotus Vagas, one of my first colonies. I received her in the beginning of February as a queen with three workers. I got her from Aesthetic Ants, a Dutch shop with everything for ants. Use code THECRAFTINGANT10 for 10% off. She was one of the first to go into my own design queen tube rooms. This was also a test. With her 15 to 18 millimeters, she was the biggest queen I had. She felt right at home and started laying eggs right away. And within weeks, there was a big pile of brood. After six weeks, the first workers started to hatch. In the founding stages, queens have to help the new workers. But now the workers are acting like big sisters, helping the new worker out of her cocoon. And as you can see, the queen was not finished. There is brood in all stages. The worker is still getting cleaned by her sisters and they are also helping unfold her body. And there she is, still a bit wobbly and as you can see she is a bit grey. This is because her outer shell isn't fully hardened yet. Another thing about the Vagas is that they are polymorphic. As you can already see, a difference in the size of workers. I really can't wait to see the mages on this species. This species of Camponotus is very defensive and for their size they are very quick. As soon as I would open the feeding area they would try to run out. This meant that they needed more space. So it was time to give them an outworld. It's the outworld made out of the cheese box and the 3D printer parts. It's also in the Campanotis Lateralis video, but I also put one together in the Ant Holliver Extra livestream. I will put the links in the description. As you can see, I put some aesthetic ant sugar water on the rock. The rock has a small divot in it. I found it outside, boiled it, and now it gives a great drinking spot. As I like these kinds of ideas, I need your help. I had the idea of you helping me and the other way around. I would like you to share ideas that you have with me. And if I like them enough and decide to make it, I will send you a copy for free. So I made an idea section on my Discord server. Post it there and we will see what we can craft. I'll put the link to the Discord in the description. The ideas can be anything and related. But now back to our Queen Beasley. As you can see, there has been a big growth in workers. We are now at 20 and that is in the 10 weeks that I've got them. 
and as you can see there is still lots of brood on the heat cable so we are far from done since Campanotus vagus can reach three to four thousand workers in the wild and ten thousand in captivity we need to start thinking of the future but more on that another day this is it for this video but not before thanking everyone for watching and helping the channel by the way if you wonder why the queen was called beasley that's because my friend beasley was my first subscriber and see where we are now don't forget to like subscribe and hit the bell icon and i hope to see you all on my discord channel see you next week at the crafting end